Hey guys, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, and you probably are, I want to ask you to consider subscribing to me, especially if you end up liking what you're about to watch. Ooh, Elf Games. I like the sound of that. Alright guys, so today I'm going to be starting a multi-part series for a game called The Children of Silent Town. I almost couldn't say that. We're off to a good start. Uh, anyway, I got it on Steam. It was on sale for like $13.99, I think. Um, yeah, so there's going to be about probably six parts. I think I'm going to break it down into the chapters. Let's get started. All right, let's pick an empty slot. Kind of excited about this. It is a known fact that we all have ears to listen and eyes to see. True. As we get older, our senses go numb and our perception fails us. Mm. However, sometimes those who have a great sight look the other way, while those who hear well do not listen. Uh oh. Because more than old age or any kind of illness, fear is often the hardest disease to treat. Okay. All right. Heard of Silent Town? No. Never heard of her. A handful of roofs standing out in the heart of the forest. No voices, no noises, only whispers and gasps. People enslaved by rules to stay safe. Hmm. Because while the forest by day was calm and peaceful, once night had fallen, you could hear them roar. The monsters. Ooh. All right. We like monsters on this channel. Spooky. That nightmare again. Yeah, okay. This art looks like, um, Sally Face, kind of. Similar. Oh! Ouch! Hey Lucy, pass the ball please. Okay, I can do that. Uh, I think this is a point and click game. Got a ball. Okay. Oh, thanks Lucy. Pass it here. Sure thing. Here we go, right, right in the face. Ooh, oh, ow. Oh, <laughs> why'd we hand it to him? Thanks, I threw it a bit too far this time. What were you doing? Mm, I had another nightmare. Oh, I see. I have nightmares a lot too. Really? How do you get the feeling to go away? Uh, me? I don't know. When I'm scared of something, I hope I hide so well that nobody can find me. That's why I'm so good at hide and seek. Want to join us? We're all playing in the square, but we need another player. Sure. Let's go. All right. Here we go. Good times. Here! Take it! Blue, you're not supposed to stop the ball. I'm gonna show you my super shot. Not again. Yeah, no one wants to see that. Blue! Okay, we have options. Say, so cut it out and play by the rules. Show me what you got. We're gonna do that. Yeah, show me. <laughs> Creepy laugh. Here comes Blue's super shot. Ooh, oh, ooh, that was super. Straight into the garden. Here we go again. All right, here comes Little Red Riding Hood. Lucy, I've been waiting for you. I told you not to be too late, remember? 
Come on, we have to make dinner. Say goodbye to your friends, dear. Why do we have to make dinner? You're the mom. You make it. I'm a kid. Hi, mom. Yes, I'm coming. I have to go, guys. See you tomorrow. Alright, here we go. Bye, Lucy. See you. Ugh. Who's gonna get the ball back now? Take care, children. It's almost evening. You should be heading home soon. Yes. <laughs> Blue, the ball! Why is it always me? Because you were born for this. Here we are. Oh, okay. We have a brother, I think. Where's that our father? Maybe that's our father. Lucy, about time you showed up. You are supposed to come home a while ago. Weren't you? Okay. Probably the father. I don't know why I thought brother. The parents look so young. Uh, why don't you help, Mom? Honey. Oh, yeah. I read that weird. Let's cook some tasty dinner and then get to bed early. Don't make us come looking for you next time, okay? Go help your mom now. You help. You're the parent. Come on. What is that? Is that a bunny? Squinty, are you still sleeping? Oh, it's a kitty. You know, purring. That was my first clue. Oh, alright, alright, alright. I thought maybe I could click the thing it was sitting on, but... I cannot. What is this? It's a locked music box. Mom says it's broken, but it's her keepsake. Out with the old, in with the new. Okay. Uh, this cupboard does what most furniture does. It contains stuff. Yeah, it sure do. Take a look at this. Uh, this is the candle we use to go down to the cellar. Alright, I take it this is the pet bed. I'm a genius! It's Squinty's bed! He sleeps anywhere but here. Okay. Well, you know what? We have cats, and they like their bed. So Squinty is a little stuck up. I guess we could help Mom now. Let's do that. Mmm, I'm hungry. Yeah. Okay, are we even helping, or are we just sitting here? <laughs> Come on, sweetheart, let's make some dinner. Can you grab the saucepan? It's hanging next to the fireplace. Okay, is it this? I got a saucepan. Sweet! We are good at this. Oh my god. There you go, Mom. This is so charming and lovely. I don't think it'll stay that way. Thank you, sweetheart. Now let's see. What else? The fireplace needs wood. Pick some up from the chest and rekindle it. I'll start working on the stew. Watch, you don't burn your fingers. Uh, maybe I want to. Maybe I'm psychotic. Ooh. Ah, you're heavy. Yeah, get your fat ass up, okay? I'm gonna pick you up. What? Okay. The cat's not moving. Uh, can we drag him? Okay. We can't drag him. What are we gonna do? How do we move the cat? Uh, interesting. Do I have anything? I don't. Do I talk to Mom? Okay. Well, that's not working. Can I go upstairs? I could. Why not? Let's take a look. Oh, there's a kitty on the door. Hey, my diary's on the floor. What's it doing there? I don't know. Better keep it with me. Yeah. Probably a good idea. Now you can see uh, the diary. Here, Lucy will write down everything she discovers as she explores the town. Okay. Alright. Uh, we haven't discovered much. Not that I expected it, us to. 
Uh, there's a sock sticking out. It's like the trunk is making a face. Hilarious. You look cool. You have my permission to stay like this forever. She's so different and quirky. <laughs> it's an extra blanket for when I feel cold. Alright. Kind of a creepy drawing. How I wish I couldn't hear the roars of the forest. <laughs> Roar, grr, growl. Squinty, my cat. He's such an adorable troublemaker. Yes. But a shock. It's full of socks. Yeah, we got a lot of socks. Okay. So what am I doing? It's been a while since I last used my ball. Blue always brings his. Is it still inflated? Oh, oh there's a toy right here. Okay. Yeah, it's not. <laughs> okay, we're taking this. That's what we're doing. It's his toy. Alright. We can lure him off of the chest. That away. Let's go! Uh, should I look in here first? Mom and Dad's room. It's locked. Okay. Huh. It's me! Terrifying. I'm a girl. I'm 12. I have a big brain. Because I'm very smart, of course. Yeah, that's why. Maybe you just have a big head. I don't know. This mirror makes my head look... Okay. She said what we were all thinking. Uh, something got put in here, didn't it? Oh, okay. The mirror. The mirror belonged to my grandparents. It's so old and deformed that it makes me look like I have a huge head. I must be really smart. Okay, we went over this already. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, let's go get Squinty to move his fat self. Here you go, Squinty. Yeah, looky here. Take that. Ah, oh, perfect. Not so smart, are you? Ooh, it runs. I want one of those. Phew! Luckily, Mom's liar didn't fall to the ground. Is that what it's called? Makes a really nice sound. I got a note. Let's take a look. Uh. Oh. Lucy notes down every unusual sound she hears in her diary, creating melodies. Once a melody is complete, you can use it in your adventure. Alright. Interesting. Now back to the fire. Okay. Now we can make progress. We've got some firewood. Yeah, I do. Alright, got the firewood. Did we give it to Mom? No. Put it in the fire. Okay. Whatever. Thought maybe she'd do it. There we go. I hear some crackling. I guess the wood was enough. Now I need some sausages from the cellar. Could you fetch them for me, Lucy? Be careful with the stairs. Take the candle. You'll need some light. Okay, we'll take the candle. Got the candle. Here it is. It's not lit, though. Can we light it in the fire? Yes. I'm very smart. Uh, perfect. What is this? The salt is safe up there for my clumsy cats. Yeah. Alright. Do we have the candle out? It's too dark. Um, lit candle. Oh. It's too dark. Uh, can I put it... Let's see, what can I do with it? Okay, a candle holder. Perfect. There we be. That's better. Ooh, veggies. You got some sausages. Okay, those are sausages. I think there's veggies here too, though. That's like corn, right? Or these sausages as well. Uh, not easy to grab them. 
when they're up so high, but the cat likes them as much as we do. Alright. I think it's me. I thought they were veggies. Here's fish. Dad says that if we dry the fish, it'll last for a long time. He knows a lot of stuff. I guess you're, he's your dad. You're just dumb. Uh, Squinty's looking at the, um, the trout. It's very adorable. Squinty, don't you even think about it. Ooh. He thinking about it. Oh, yes, he is. I made this when I was learning how to hammer nails. Getting the huh, getting them to go in straight is hard. Yeah. Maybe I should take them out someday. Maybe, but we won't. I highly doubt it. What is this? It's an old rusty sickle. Anything else down here to look at? I don't think so. I think what we we got what we came for. Uh, yeah? Oh. Now that I think about it. What are we doing? Squinty, leave the fish be. Shoo! Ooh. He's not happy. What a little pest. Yeah, we probably wanted to use a different word. But we went with the G-rated one. Are you talking about Luca? It's been two days already. His father didn't want people to know, but it's crystal clear. Oh no. This habit hasn't happened in so long. Will we ever be free? Don't be a fool. It will never end. Do not forget. This is why we have rules. Yeah, okay. Dear, nobody can forget that ever. Not even for one night. How can you say such things? It's been a long time since silence fell on this town. Interesting. Yeah, I know, I know. But it happened. And it will happen again. We were caught off guard. What will his father do now? Lucy? Aw. We were snooping! I'll go see him tomorrow. Let's try not to think about it right now. Yeah, everything's fine. Were they talking about another missing person? <sighs> Obviously. Should we talk to our father? All right, he has nothing to say. He's done with us. Mom? Yes, Lucy? Well... No, nothing. Yeah, okay. I heard a noise earlier. Was Squinty in the cellar again? Yeah. He was up to no good, wasn't he? Well, anyway, do you have the sausages? <laughs> you know I do. You can count on me to be the sausage girl. Alright, that sounds bad. Mmm, can you smell that? This is going to be delicious. Let's see, what else? Oh yeah, some salt! It's on the shelf, Lucy. Can you please grab it? Then you can go play. Of course. Thank you, sweetheart. How do you know about the salt? That's up too high. How can I reach it? Maybe that's... Huh, I need your help, stool. Yeah, okay. Got a stool. Uh, right there. Squinty, stop! Oh no. Wow. Lucy! Ugh, you're okay, I was so scared. Now the mom just turns around and kills the cat. That's the end of the game. Uh, anyway. Forgive me, it was too high for you. Don't worry about dinner, I can handle it from here. As for you, little pest, get out! Oh, oh, he in trouble? Ooh, ooh. Go out and play. I'm on it. Sure. Where are you going, Lucy? The sun is setting. You should stay home. Uh oh, conflicting. Conflicting information. But it's still light outside. I'd like to stay out a bit more. I won't go far. 
Tell you what, when dinner's ready, I'll call you. And then you come back home immediately. Sound good? He's not sure. Alright. Yeah, sure. Just don't go too far. The town is not safe after dusk. Yes, Pappy. Uh, uh, Luis? It's just for a few minutes, and it's just in front of the house. You know why I'm worried. I want Lucy to be safe. And you're too lenient. Yeah, she is. Probably gonna regret that. Stupid cat knocked me over. Now I'm gonna have a bump on my head. Uh, that's what cats do. The woodworker is really good at his job. Uh, more li- more- oh, mom's liar is his work. Is that how you pronounce that? I don't even know. The woodworker always leaves his tools lying around, and then gets angry if you touch anything. Bleh. Well, it's too heavy for me anyway. Okay, what's this? The woodworker is crafting a new instrument. wonder what it sounds like. Interesting. Okay. Not what I expected. Yes. True. Who would even want something like this? We got a sticker. Take a look. Uh, the woodsman can make anything, even musical instruments. One day I'll ask him to craft one for me too. I still don't know what though. Okay. Are we missing something? There's something in the middle, but I don't know if they have to be in order. Um, what else is there to look at? More wood. Yes, this is where he works. Better not touch anything. Every morning, the woodworker goes to the forest to collect wood. Everyone in ta <coughs> town relies on him. Sorry, I'm still regaining my voice. <clears throat> I'd like to learn more about the forest, but he never talks to anyone. Sometimes when we play hide and seek, I slip in here, assuming there's no woodworker around. He once threatened to lock us in. Ooh. That's not very nice. Alright, I think we've seen everything over here. Oh, oh, there's an old lady in the yard. Get out of here. Uh... Sorry, Mr. Spider. Yeah, you're not sorry. Kitty kitty, what happened to your fur? You're all covered in salt. His name is Squinty. He knocked me over when I was getting the salt. He's a real pest, always looking for trouble. Oh, <laughs> but of course cats can be mischievous, but also very clever. Did you mistreat him? Maybe he doesn't like you anymore. No, I'm sure that's not it. I can see that you are a good girl. Not like these cowards, whispering all the time. Bah. Hmm? Believe me, child, they're all crazy around here. I'm a crazy old lady. You can trust me. Yeah. Right, Furball? You can trust this crazy old lady. Can we? Wait. Here, take this. You got a sticker. Huh. Alright. Lucy, you have to be very brave. Understood? Uh, what do you mean? Uh, dumb old lady. You'll never give in, right? Huh. Perhaps she really is a bit troubled. Yeah, perhaps. She probably is. The sign shows the way to the well in the square. Alright, let's look at the sticker she gave us. It's a bracelet made of pencil stubs. A crazy old lady made it. I've heard she was a teacher. I don't know if that's true. Oh yeah. The teachers always become crazy old ladies. Trust me, we all know them. We've all seen them. 
The junk has been here since they stopped working on the flower bed. I don't think they'll ever finish. I call it the scrap track. Okay. Uh, there's a bell. Mm-hmm. It won't ring if there's no clapper. Okay, is there anything else out here to look at? Hmm. It's the woodkeeper's dog kennel. <laughs> okay, where's the dog? Alright, it doesn't look... Yeah, alright. Mommy said not to leave the alley. Well, we won't do that then. Seems like the handle might break off at any moment. Oh, whoops, it actually came off. Got a weird handle. Uh, can we ring the bell with it? Seems to fit the bell perfectly. Uh-oh. Ah, uh, music to my ears. Got a note. Let's take a look. What's the note? Alright. Lucy, dinner's ready. Time to come home. Coming. Yeah. You look like a little goth. Come on, Squinty. Let's go. Squinty? Oh no, no, no. Squinty causing more trouble. Where are you going? Get back here! Uh-oh... Squinty, it's dark already! Oh... Squinty? Squinty, please! Oh no. Where are you? Oh, we're getting cold. Okay. Uh oh. What was that? Is it the old lady? Squinty, is that you? I don't... I don't like it here. Yeah. Ooh. Oh no. Did we make it back home? There's something out there. Who knows what happened to Squinty? Yeah. Huh. There he is, Squinty! Thought you were gone. But you've been here safe the whole time. While well, I. You're a bad cat. I won't look for you ever again. <laughs> Lucy, dinner's ready. We're just waiting for you. Coming. Alright, yeah. Go on, Squinty. Lucy? Yeah? Nice, nice. Got another note. Let's take a look. What is that? Well done, Lucy. That was very good. Let's stop here for today. No, please, just a bit more. But Lucy, it's late. Also, weren't you the one who didn't want to study singing? No, I like it now. Oh, really? Changed? I thought it would be boring, but I like singing with you. Alright. Then let's sing a bit more. Yes. Oh, how touching. I think I might throw up.
All right.